Sometimes you just need to edit or would like to add content directly without the visual clutter behind your photos, clip art, and design of your presentation. This is what Outline View is for. Let's get into Outline View by going to View ribbon tab and selecting Outline View. Now what happens is all your slides go away and you're left with a text-only version of your presentation. The neat thing is I can still click on any of these slides and see what they look like on the right-hand side. But I can actually edit this text directly right here in this navigator. For example, I can come down here, and you remember our products and development slide that we worked on a couple of videos back. I can work on this right in line from this view. So I'm going to put my cursor over here at the end where I want to delete a line, hit the backspace key, and it's just like I'm working on it in line. In fact, I can even look over here on the right and see what I've changed. Alternatively, I can add more by coming down here to the bottom and typing. The neat thing is I can even create new slides this way. For example, when I hit enter, it's going to make a new bullet point. But like we learned, we can promote or demote bullet points. Well, in outline view, that actually creates new slides when you promote a bullet point. For example, I'm going to hit the shift tab key on my keyboard. That's actually outdented that bullet point, which in outline mode will create a brand new slide. So now I can start typing just like my cursor was actually in that slide. Now, I hit enter after I wrote the title of the slide. So PowerPoint thinks I'm creating a new slide, but don't worry. I can just hit the tab key on my keyboard, and it brings me back to the original slide. And now I'm in a position where I can add some bullet points. So I can just start typing, hit enter, and it'll create new bullet points. You can even see what it's doing on the right-hand side. And I can skip a space if I want and write some more. I can even hit the tab key and make sub bullets. So this is a really fast way to add content directly to your slide. Here's a neat little tip. If you're working in Microsoft Word to create a presentation, you can actually create an outline in Word, copy it, come into a new PowerPoint presentation, paste it in outline view, and you'll have an entire presentation's worth of content already done. After that, it's just going to be up to you to add things like video and themes and backgrounds, but you can do that easily once all the content's in place. So definitely check out Outline View. See if you like and can get used to working with just content, and you'll probably discover that it's a really fast way to start working on some great content.